Yo, what's up guys? It's Preston. Today we're doing a new video. I'm doing a bit, little bit of a room tour, uh, setup tour, you know, stuff like that that I have going on, how I make the videos and everything like that. And uh, it'll be all explained. I'll have everything in here that I have all my setup in the description below. So everything will be good to go. But I guess I'll go ahead and start with like this side of the room. So over here I got a, I got a FaZe Clan jersey. Uh, I got this from the New York CSGO event. Uh, I got it seen by, uh, let's see, we got Nico, we got Kerrigan, we got Rain, Olaf, uh, Guardian. You know, the whole FaZe Clan CSGO team got signed, met them, shook their hands and everything, which was really cool. And then uh, I got an Alienware bag because we were VIP, so like that. I got signed by uh, Sponge and uh, Henry G. Those guys are the cool people out there. I love those guys. Got to play CSGO with them and uh, stuff like that. Over here, I just got some, like, hoodies and stuff. Nothing really important. Got a Logic hoodie that I got from one of his uh, concerts. Got an Alienware bag again from a New York event that I went to. A couple jackets, paintball gun. My turtle. What's up, dude? He's my OG friend. Love him. But uh, we go over here, we just got some shoes. It's cool stuff. Virginia Rocks lanyard. Thanks to Danny Duncan. Love him. Uh, don't worry about that. It's an old computer I'm working on. Uh, so here we can start off with uh, some nice cologne. But uh, this is my desk. It's an L desk. You can get these off of Amazon. A buddy of mine bought Dusty Just actually ordered one. He's going to be putting his setup together soon, actually. Uh, they're pretty cheap. It's like 100 bucks for a pretty nice desk. Had this for a couple years, actually. I like it. Um, here we have my uh, Cougar Armor gaming chair. It's pretty nice. I love it. Had it for uh, probably two years now, I guess. A year, maybe. Uh, it's really comfortable. No wear or tear or anything like that. Pretty nice stuff. Uh, over here, I guess I'll... Actually, I'll just go right, right to left. Uh, yeah, more of that chapstick. So we have an Xbox controller because do play Xbox, I have an Xbox One. Um, never really play it, so there's really no point in me talking about it. I don't really play it that much. But here we have the Razer Firefly. It's a hard mat, um, mouse, pad, whatever you want to call it. It's not really a pad, it's just super nice, durable, very nice for the Razer products to move on each other on. It's really nice. Uh, here we have the, what is that, the Razer Mama Tournament Edition. Very nice. I love it. Got to go with the blue teal scheme, as in uh, my LED lights that I have. Running up behind my setup and stuff all over the place, which is cool. And I'll get into those later. Uh, here we have an Amazon. Amazon Dot. Alexa. You can see she's uh, she does her thing. Sorry, I don't know that one. Yeah, she's really annoying. <laughs> um, here we have the Razer. I think it's a Black Widow. 2017 tournament edition uh it's got the uh clicky keys and stuff like that it's really nice keyboard i love it really nice uh here's the remote actually for the leds the red's a little jacked up on it but we can change the colors to blue and all that stuff but i prefer the teal looks pretty nice iphone charger and we have a benq uh 27 inch 1920 by 1080p uh monitor it's got like two or one millisecond response time. They're pretty nice. Had them for a couple years. Um, got two of them for my dual setup, but they're pretty nice. I like them a lot. Um, got them for Christmas. Uh, I got my PS4 controller. This is the only one I got. I don't really play multiplayer. I just play online with friends and stuff. So here's my PS4. It's a Black Ops 3 Edition 1 terabyte. Very nice, very useful. I like it a lot. Um, so if we move on, I guess we'll go to another monitor of a nasty old Logitech 720 HD cam. I, the only time I ever use that would be for streaming and stuff like that, but streams are not that big right now, so I don't really use them that much. But uh, this is probably the biggest part of my setup right here besides my computer is my, my headset. It's the Turtle Beach Elite Pro 2s. They are very nice, it's a very pricey headset. I needed them because my Elite Pro 1s, they uh, started to break with the extended warranty, so I got these instead. Um, comes with a mix amp and a fiber optical cable for your PS4 or Xbox. They have two different kinds. They have the Xbox version and the PS4 version, which is nice. But it comes with everything you need besides the splitter cable. And this, if you have an old Elgato, unlike me, I have like the HD or something like that. It's the first one they ever came out with. 
Um, but yeah, that's the headset. Really nice and comfortable. Um, I like it a lot. It's got a mic that can detach and everything like that. So if I don't want to use them, use that mic. I can just take it off and use my uh, my Blue Yeti I got here. I love this Blue Yeti Pro. It's a very nice headset or headset mic microphone. Um, and then I got the newer uh, mic arm right here, movable arm that I got off Amazon, like 20 bucks. Pretty nice. Uh, down here, here's my computer. I'll put the specs and everything down there. Ignore the cable management and everything. I just worked on that the other day. Um, but yeah, that's my computer. I've had it for two or three years. Uh, it's pretty outdated. I can actually just go ahead and pull up the specs on here real quick for you. D X D I A G. I'll pull up the uh, diagnostics for you real quick. That's what they call them. So, motherboard, I'm running an H170 Gaming 3 motherboard. Uh, it's by Gigabyte. It's pretty nice. I got an i5 6600K running at 3.5 gigahertz right now. It's got four CPUs, 16 gigs of RAM at DDR4. Uh, I think it's 3200. I'm running those at. And then if I go over to display, I'm running a NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1063 gig overclocked. But I didn't overclock it because I figured, you know, there would be no point. But that gets the job done for when I'm just PC gaming, doing some live streaming, recording, stuff like that. Um, so we already went over the PS4 and the Xbox. Uh, this is pretty cool. This is my controller for my, uh, my Unix drone that I have that is currently broken. I have to get, send it back and get it fixed. But um, I'll do that in a separate video. I'll do some footage of that. Uh, here's my GoPro. Uh, it's my Hero 4 Black, I think. Yeah, it's pretty nice. I was gonna record it with... I was gonna record it with this, but I decided not to because the iPhones have excellent quality, so. Uh, here are just a couple bracelets, USB sticks, anything like that, chargers, you know, Ethernet area. This is all my networking stuff back here. Um, this lamp, actually, it's how I use my lighting for when I'm recording. And surprisingly, it's just like a regular lamp. I'm not a professional, so I don't really care. You gotta live with what you got. Uh, here's my my network. Got an Ethernet cable running in from the wall here. It runs through here, and there's actually something on my roof that is... Uh, getting signal from a town that's like 30 miles away it's getting me signal from to the roof of my house and i get like it depends when they're messing with the signal or anything like that but usually it's like 300 down and like 100 up you know it's super fast um it's called air fiber it's pretty nice but we got a usb cable running into here and from my neck here nighthawk r7000 uh it's a very nice router very high end uh works very nice does what it needs to do uh, there's nothing else really about that to complain because there's just, I mean, this thing is godlike. I mean, it's very nice. It is pricey, but it gets the job done pretty well. So, uh, I guess we move on down here to the network uh, cable management area. So, this is my Elgato HD. Yeah, it's just my Game Capture HD Elgato right here that I've had for a couple years. Hopefully, to get a new one, I got some random cables, some old computers here that I work on, some games. PS4 games, Xbox 360, Xbox One, original Xbox, and uh, some watches and stuff like that. Really cool poster my nephew got me. I like that a lot. Um, but here's here's the inside of my computer. I need to get a new fan on the back. It's not spinning, but I mean, there's I mean, it's cold air coming out of there, so it's not really that big of a deal. It's pretty cooled off in there. But uh, here's the back. Here's the back of my setup here. Looks pretty nice. I really like my setup here. It's pretty nice. It's not that clean, but gets the job done. Dual monitor setup, you know. Nothing would be better. I got my. How big is that? It's a 40 inch LED TV up there. Pretty nice for him just watching Netflix, chilling, doing stuff. Uh, so if we move over here. This is like my price position, not the air duster. Get that out of here. Uh, this is my G Fuel collection. Uh, really prized. This is my prized possessions right here. I mean, I love these things. I'm always giving stuff away to friends, shakers, stuff like that, because I'm always buying stuff. But I'm a pretty big Dr. Disrespect fan, so of course I got a couple of Doc shakers and um, all kinds of different flavors and stuff. I got like FaZe ones, because I'm a big FaZe fan, always has. I've loved FaZe. Um, always wanted to get into FaZe since I was a kid. 
Uh, so we got like three, three or four phase shakers. Got your Dick's respect. Limited edition collector's box one, which is nice. Got some G Fuel in the bag here because I got some for free. Um, we got an Apex shaker. We got Baseberry. We got Black on Blackberry that came with the uh, dock shaker. And uh, we got all kinds of flavors in there, actually. Uh, you name it. Here, I'll go over all of them. So in here, I got strawberry shortcake. I got rainbow sherbet in here, which I probably won't be drinking anytime soon because I'm more of a fruity guy. So, uh, let's see here. We got phase berry. We got strawberry shortcake. Blue ice, like from the original tubs. We've got sour cherry, which is bomb. Old phase berry one. Uh, I got tropical rain in here. I got some cherry limeade back here, which is nice. Um, I got some grape. Some tropical rain, which is great, but I don't have any more. Rainbow sherbet. And I believe that is the lemonade one back there, which is nice. Good flavor. And the rest of my shakers are in here too, actually. I just gotta get those out. Another baby Dr. Disrespect one and an eight shot one. That's really cool. So those are my favorites. All everything here is my favorite. I love it. And here's nothing important, just some old stuff. Cables, crap like that that I need for computer stuff. Air duster for cleaning the computers and stuff. I'm not sitting there huffing and puffing on it. Um, this is just a bunch of random stuff. It's you know not important. Uh, this is pretty important though. This watch got a couple nice watches actually. I love it. A, I'm a big Blue Angels fan, um, so that's my special watch that my parents got me. All right, and this is also really cool. I got a G Fuel bag, uh, but it broke on me. I was using it during the last track season, and like it like kind of started to rip on the side, you know. And I was like, Yo, can I guys like can you guys just send me a new one? And they said. I don't know all that, so I was like, whatever, that's a bummer, but it's a cool bag. I'm going to keep that for a long time. Uh, here are my MSI jerseys that I got from the CSGO event. They're pretty cool. Got some hats, got some human liquid hats in there, MSI hats, ESL shaker, um, all kinds of stuff in here, actually, you know, I think about it. I got, like, some really cool stuff in here. I got, like, some coasters from at t because they really hooked it up. This is really heavy. I don't know what's in this. I'm about to see. Oh, we got like a banner that says something on it. Um, a little book, scrapbook. Uh, what appears to be yeah, like keychains, um, stuff like that. And these are really cool. Uh, this is like my prized possessions right here from the event. Let's get this down real quick. It says ESL on it, and when you open it up, it's got the. Uh, the official ESL one uh, coin in there. Pretty nice, actually. Really heavy. That's really cool. Barclay Center. Went all the way up to New York from Virginia for this event. So that was really cool. Lots of good people there that I got to meet. Put this away real quick. I don't know what the sign says. Oh, it just says let's go on it. It's an alien one. Thing. Um, yeah, so they really hooked it up at that event that I went to. Um, I'll put some footage of that probably in the video so you guys can watch um, some of the things that happened there. But that's a lot of the stuff in there. Just the only thing we've done, everything we've done. Some really cool stuff. Got a pair of sunglasses. Yeah, just some mugs. Yeah, it's just, you know, cool stuff. Got a shirt in there. This is, uh, ESL New York on it. It's got like a CSGO guy on it. ESL 1. And I think that writing, yeah, it's like, yeah, it's just really cool. I like it. They really hooked it up. Especially if you're like VIP and stuff like that. And they gave us like a little charger thing like this. I don't even know. A whole bunch of random stuff in there that I have to go through and organize. But that's that. Uh, and if you look up here, this is my G Fuel collect. Uh, no, it's just like a sticker collection. Danny Duncan uh, Limited. It was only available for people that got his ugly sweater. I'm a big Danny Duncan fan. Uh, these are all my G Fuel stickers, actually, now that I think about it. I got a whole bunch of phase ones, tropical rain ones back in there. I've got all kinds of Virginia Rock stuff, stuff like that, video game stuff, all kinds of different knickknacks and stuff up here. Big phase fans, you can tell, obviously. Phase rain, you yeah, know, love you. Hope you're doing good, man. Lots of bad stuff happening lately, but I also have Corgi, so I love Corgi puppies. I don't know if that's weird or anything, but hey, I mean, it's got all those corgis. But 
that's that. Uh, that's pretty much everything. Hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, it wasn't much of a video, but it was something to do and edit it today, get uploaded. So, all right, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Uh, peace out.